by ourselves. Your Uncle Joey didn't make parole again. I think it would be nice if you all dropped him a line. Uncle Jailbird Joey? He's your brother, Mom. Yeah, I think it's a major embarrassment having an uncle in prison. We all make mistakes in life, children. Damn it, I'm like... What you say to me? to me like that? How dare you? Talk to me like that one more time, I turn you into the siu pao! Hey Marty. I'm at your answering service while you're outside pouting over the car. Jennifer Parker called you twice. I don't like her, Marty. Any girl who calls up a boy is just asking for trouble. Oh, Mom, there's nothing wrong with calling a boy. I think it's terrible. Girls chasing boys. When I was your age, I never chased a boy or called a boy or sat in a parked car with a boy. Then how am I supposed to ever meet anybody? Well, it'll just happen. Like the way I met your father. I was so stupid, Grandpa hit him with the car. It was meant to be. Anyway, if Grandpa hadn't hit him, then none of you would have been born. Yeah, well, I still don't understand what Dad was doing in the middle of the street. What was it, George? Bird watching? What, Lori? What? Anyway, your Grandpa hit him with the car and brought him into the house. He seemed so helpless. Like a little lost puppy. And my heart just went out to him. Yeah, Mom, we know. You've told us this story a million times. You felt sorry for him, so you decided to go with him to the fish under the sea dance. No, no. It was, it was the night of that terrible thunderstorm. Remember, George? <sighs> Father kissed me for the very first time on that dance floor. And it was then that I realized that I was going to spend the rest of my life with him.